Come at me, bro. I have a TNT cannon. You won't stand a chance. Hey, what's up, my fellow teammates? Welcome back to another redstone tutorial here in Minecraft Pocket Edition. We are going to be taking a look at how to build an awesome TNT cannon using basic Minecraft redstone. So let's go ahead and get started, guys. Here is my TNT cannon. Let's go ahead and test this out by basically hitting this button, and it should go ahead and activate the first bit of TNT and then shoot off the final one, which is going to be our cannon. So take a look at that, guys. That is so freaking epic. You could use this to defend your home, attack your enemies, and pretty much anything that could come to mind. So let's go ahead and take a look at how to build it. It is really simple, guys. What we need to do is first build up an area like so. So it's like two by two. And then we come on over to this side, skip a block, and do the same thing. And then we want to go ahead and build this down by nine blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then we want to go ahead and do the same on this side as well. And then we would connect it up right here at the back and then go right up to the front, place down a block right over here, place down a block over here, destroy this block. And then we could go ahead and now begin to place down our redstone. The redstone is going to go right here, here, then we want to place one down right over here, 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 and all the way down till we get to the second to last block on this area. Now once you have that guys, you don't need any more TNT, you just want to go ahead and come on over and grab ourselves a water bucket, place it down at the back block on the uh, TNT cannon, and it should go all the way back down, touching the first block. Once you have that, grab yourselves a slab, place it right over here, just in case, because you don't want to place down any TNT in that hole since it is our water block source. Now once you have that guys, you want to go ahead and place down our rail system, which is going to allow us to activate all of our redstone. We want to place it down right over here, two of our powered rails, place down a regular rail, then place down a detector rail, and repeat this pattern until you get to the other side. So basically two more power rails, a regular rail, a detector rail, and a powered rail, and you can really use anything that you want. I am just uh, using, you know, a plethora of expensive items because I'm on creative mode, but um, yeah, like I mentioned, pretty much anything would be just fine as long as it gets to the other side. So there we go, guys, adding in some more detector rails and more powered rails, and there is uh, a specific rail that you need, and it's going to be a detector rail right on top of that block, which is going to activate this bit of redstone. Now, once you have that guys you want to go ahead and grab yourselves a minecart as well as a button and the button is going to allow us to activate the first bit of redstone as well as send our minecart down the track so as you can see when I go ahead and click on this button it activates that bit of redstone and sends our minecart all the way down and then it should activate the last bit of TNT all right, guys, so let's go ahead and now load up our TNT cannon by basically placing TNT in this area right over here, and the water source block should be under our slab. We place down a TNT right over there, and then a minecart, and then we hit that button. It should activate all the TNT, pushing it down with the water, and finally, there we go. That is our TNT cannon, guys. Really simple and awesome. Yet again, you could use this in a series of different ways to attack or defend yourself. And finally, guys, before I end the video, I want to go ahead and ask you a question. I've been looking for a name for my audience besides teammates for a while, and it's really hard to come up with, so if you guys have any ideas for a short name that's related to my channel and that's, like, really fun and easy to say, definitely tell me in the comment section down below, and I might use that forever. So, yeah, guys, that's really cool, and if you guys enjoyed the video, please take one second to smack the like button. I definitely appreciate it, and yeah, this was Twist, and I'll see you guys later.